Hello, everybody. Welcome, welcome, welcome to Victoria 3. It's actually out. By the time you're watching this video, it's out right now. You can go play it. Uh, but if you're watching this, I just let you know, I am recording this on October 12th. So about two weeks prior to uh, it actually being live. So we're going to play two sisters today. It is the country that did win our poll. Um, so they said, who do people want to see? They said they want to see uh, Italy. We're going to be unifying Italy as two Sicilies here today. Um, but again, I'm recording this about two weeks prior to it being released. So uh, I appreciate comments. I, I, I encourage comments to tell me what I'm doing wrong in this game. Uh, but just note that I can't really take any of the advice given to me. Uh, because again, it, the whole series will probably be recorded by the time the first episode goes live. But again, leave those comments. I want to I wanna know, one, what everybody's thinking of Victoria 3 so far, and two, um, how I'm freaking everything up. So again, we're going to be doing, uh, we're going to be getting Italy unified. So I did try recording this a little bit earlier. I did screw it up slightly. Um, because I accidentally pressed the wrong button and I kind of made myself a puppet state by accident. But this time I won't do it. Charismatic, 5 influence, 10% morality. 10% command limits. Brave? I mean, Brave's pretty good. We'll get you as our uh, general. So I have not I have not personally watched any of the pre-release streams, so I probably will be doing stuff wrong. And I, I hope you can all forgive me for that. Uh, but what we're going to be doing is we're going to be forming Italy. Uh, I will show you in our journal what we need to actually, you know, unify Italy. So we're going to need to be in rank of a major power, which we are. We do not need. We need to be, not be a subject country of another nation, which we're not. We need to get nationalism, which is why I got mass communication as my first research. So we need that in order to research nationalism. But after that, when we invite countries into our custom union, uh, and we have high relations with them, they will unify with us. And I'm assuming eventually we will be able to uh, form Italy, which will be nice for us. But I want you in my custom union. I don't want to join yours. I want to get Sardinia to Pima in my custom union. My thing I did before is I joined their custom union. It's very different. It's very different. So I'm going to improve relations with all three of our independent Italian states. So we got Lucia down here, Modena, and Parma. They are all um, in the Austrian uh, custom union. I'll probably end up just calling it Sphere of Influence just to make it a little bit easier myself. But they're doing their own thing over there. We can support more declared interest. We want to clear interest in all of our kind of like neighboring areas. Fantastic. Expensive government goods. We need paper. We can import that. We'll import that from Russia for now. We have unused construction. So yes. One thing I want to do, first and foremost, is we want to get our construction capacity higher. We can do that one by getting iron frame buildings, which is going to be uh, some more points here. So we can have 14.73 construction value, um, which we use to build buildings, which is nice. But what I want to do first is I want to improve um, how much we can actually build at once. So we're going to get some construction. Probably like, let's get like one in every single state. I don't know if that makes a huge difference whether or not we get one really good versus getting a handful of decent ones across the country. Well, we'll get all this stuff built up, and they should grant us more construction value. I don't know by how much. How much each one of these are. Yes, we want to invite them. 43. What we need to do is we need to get them down to 30. So we get them down to negative 30 for accepting proposal. We can offer them an obligation, which is going to be a 30-point uh, swing in our favor. I mean, it could theoretically probably form an alliance. You know what? Let's get an alliance with Sardinia Piedmont right away. It's going to be an immediate 30-point boost. And we can hopefully, at that point, invite them into our custom union right away. They're making 1,000 pounds right now. We have 320 influence. They have accepted our uh, alliance. We're going to stop improving relations with them right now. Again, I want them in my custom union. 1% progress each day towards increased relations. Max up plus 80. So again, they're not going to say yes to it right now. Mostly just because of base reluctance. Pimeonian GDP, 3.25 million compared to our GDP, 
ideological similarities, and they like us. But eventually, I think we will be getting an opinion bonus due to having, um... Due to us having an alliance, which is nice. What else we have? Insufficient taxation capacity. I'll be honest, I don't really know how to... Fix this? Because usage is higher than capacity. The following effects are applied to the state. Usage is higher than capacity. One point of taxation capacity is acquired per 10,000 pops. So I'm guessing we're not able to effectively collect taxes around here. Which you can maybe do by increasing government wages. Do intelligence approval. Government wages. Goods for government buildings. How does that actually affect us here for... Uh, for taxation capacity, though. Also, one thing I do want to do is I want to uh, put a consumption tax right now on liquor. Gives a little bit of extra cash we can use. And it costs a little bit of our, our authority points here. We still have 722, so I'm still looking pretty uh, still looking pretty good there. 734,000 pounds in the bank. What else do we have? Urbanized two Sicilies. I want to see if we can get like kind of all of this stuff going. Two Sicilies and Monarchy. The following must be true for 30 years. So as long as we kind of keep... Everything in Two Sicilies at the level it's at now. We'll have finished this uh, journal, this this objective. At least 75% of all eligible Sicilian states um, have an urban center. Any Sicilian state is incorporated state. It's building an urban center and building level is greater or equal to 10. Okay. And this is any Sicilian building has building arts academy, has activated traditional art. The over uh, the workforce occupancy is greater or equal to 90%. So there's a, there's a lot of stuff in here, and there's even more stuff down here we can get eventually. Outlier cultures. Right now, we have racial segregation. We have state religion. We can't pass anything because nobody would ever... I mean, it's got, I mean, it's got like a little bit of approval, 10.4%, but we can't pass it anyways. And actually, is there any laws that we can pass? Listen, can I reform the government at all? Can I bring more people into the... Uh, into the governing uh, coalition. What do we bring like the Catholic Church? It's a 4% legitimacy penalty. What are like the armed forces? Negative 19%. We get more legitimacy if we bring the armed forces in here. They're royalists. You guys are moderates. You're neutral right now. You're happy. The happiness is a 10% authority boost. You guys are happy, which is a 20% influence boost. And if we get the armed forces happy, it's going to be a 20% military tech reduction cost, which actually is pretty good. The intelligentsia hates us. Uh, it's a 10% uh, prestige penalty, which is not great. I mean, I would like to get him happy because I would like the uh, the social tech bonus, but we can't really afford it right now. And you are a legitimacy boost. So yeah, let's, let's bring the armed forces into our governing coalition. It's a little bit more legitimate. And is there any laws we can pass? A little bit, but really not too much. Interventionalist can go agrarianism. How does that affect us? Investment pool. Aristocrats. I think we won't change you too much. We also can't pass any laws here. Colonial affairs. Bureaucracy costs minus 70. How much bureaucracy do we have? We have 77 points right now. Colonial exploitation. We don't have any colonies right now, so I don't know if getting any of those make any sense. And taxation, right now we're consuming per capita taxation, which is land tax, per capita tax, income tax, and consumption tax. We could go down to land-based taxation. Predicted revenue is 24000 so it's a big loss of income, and you're even worse, actually. So I, I do like how there's different ways that you can tax the population. Per capita, which is a, we, kind of, we kind of tax everything a little bit. You can have it to, you know, where you only tax land, there's no income tax, or there's very little income tax, very little consumption tax. You can have just consumption where you don't tax land, you don't tax income. All you do is you tax the, um, the use of goods, which I'm assuming there are some situations where you would want this. I don't know what they are. And then, of course, you have, like, graduation, graduated taxation, which I believe is... What, I mean, proportional tax, gradual, I think is mostly what is used nowadays, but I'm not 100% too sure on that. Local police force, dedicated police force. 
20% state penalties for uh, turmoil, plus 10% landowner political strength. Plus two max law enforcement institu uh, institution investment. Negative 5% radicals. Negative 50% state penalties for turmoil. And what else do we have? We also have some stuff over here. We have a professional army. We could go up to peasant levies, but I'm, I'm, I'm going to say probably a professional army is better. And internal security. Right now we have no home affair. The oxy costs negative 70. Can mobilize 33 to, uh, battalions, which I think is more than we can do now. Yeah, right now we can mobilize 21. So we will be able to get like a bigger army. And honestly, I mean, that, that, that probably is worthwhile. 0% conscription rate, negative 10% revolution, succession, prog progression speed. Yeah, you know what? Let's, I mean, also we have a 25% boost. The only people opposing this right now is Intellectia, but they don't, they don't like us. Actually, but, but I, I kind of want them to like me. Because we get them to like us, we could get a like, well, one, we won't have a 10% prestige penalty for one. But I mean, our government right now is fairly conservative. I, I don't think trade unions will oppose you. The land folks endorse this. But I don't think we want you. And subsidize. Lux government run uh, railways. Maybe we just don't pass any law right now. I know. No, let's, let's go for the National Guard first. I think it makes sense for us to be able to mobilize more units. Just, just on the off chance something bad happens. We really are not uh, taxing you very well at all. But I'm sure we'll be able to overcome that eventually. So we're 14 out of 15. We're only using 14. Okay, now we're using 15. And then two weeks we'll get you. So do each one of you provide one point? 50 construction costs. Predicted earnings, not enough qualifications to fully staff this building. I mean, that's great. You know, we don't need to staff the buildings. That's fine. And raising concerns. The landowners have expressed a concern about government decision clearly favoring the interests of the industrialists. I mean, I kind of... I mean, what, what means... Where, where are your... Um, we have so many so many little pop-ups here. Commanders, enact National Guard. Where is the, um, the outlier... Yeah, have the yeah. I want the interest groups outlined. The other ones, I don't think we need. Eh, we'll, we'll pin the market as well. So right now, the landlords are twenty-two percent. How much do they like us? Clout twenty-two percent. They're, they're happy plus eight. I kind of want the industrialists to get. I think it's ten percent political strength. Negative one interest group approval. But I want to urbanize. I want to I want to urbanize so the, the landowners look for right now you don't you don't matter so much okay like like no no offense but oh we also need iron does anybody selling iron on the cheap Austria is okay and you cost I know you cost yeah you cost bureaucracy to use trade routes minus 140 law enforcement minus 69 nice population in core states Base value, government administration assistance, government administration and comp Okay, so we can build more government assistance. Well, actually, let's also import some steel from Morocco as well. Bureaucratic shortfall. Our country's institutions are growing out of bounds. We will eventually be overstretched. Until we are able to fully ensure sufficient bureaucracy for all of them, further institution growth will halt. Institutions. Okay. So right now we're in law enforcement... We cannot afford 69 bureaucracy acquired at this investment level. So are you not going to... Total weekly cost. So 69. It, okay, so it gets better as, as it goes up. Okay. You go to level 3 theoretically. But I don't think... Do we need to worry about this? I mean, we could cut one of our... Okay, you know what? Let, let's just build the administration building that they want. Which is, I think, in... Where is that? It's in urban? 
Trade Center, Government Administration. Yes, I want to build... Either one of you would make you better. You have filing cabinets. You'd become more efficient if we had better filing cabinets, but right now we can't really do anything with you. Trade Centers. You could expand it. How expensive are they? 300. I mean, okay, they're, they're a little expensive. We're at 16 on 16. Yeah, so each one of you is a one point. But I want these first. Yeah, throw you to the top of the list. And have that being built as quickly as you can. We're at 16 out of 17 now. Can I make my... um? Can I make the construction buildings any better? Actually, is there anything we can do in here? Sweeteners. We have jars. Pot stills. I don't think so. I'm assuming we'll probably get... I mean, we could build luxury furniture. 1,000 more shopkeepers, but I think it's not... I think it's saying that's going to lose us money. Yes, I think it's going to be even worse for us. Make ceramic substitution negative 1.6. Okay, so it's expensive. We really can't do too, too much there. So you're, you guys are at 32. Will any of you want to join my custom union yet? I mean, I guess it's only March. And you won't say yes. You're negative 49. If we can grow our GDP a little bit more, we can probably get Sardinia Piedmont to, to agree to it. Maybe. If we're, if we're, if we're lucky. Um, population. How are people actually feeling about us? Right now, shopkeepers actually the most political strength. Then the aristocrats and the clergymen. How do, how do the shopkeepers, the owners and managers of stores, how do they have the most influence in the entire country? I don't really know. But they're, they're very powerful. The press, bolster any of you. I don't think we need to bolster any of you. Bureaucrats right now are middling. Because like, overall, I feel pretty good. I feel, I feel decent with where we're at. And how's our law going? 20% chance of success. But every... We'll have an event soon. 41% chance that it advances. 38.7% chance that there's a debate, but it's not going to stall in government. I mean, that's nice, right? That, 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 that's, a, that's a positive. Buildings develop. We have oh, yeah, now we have 25 construction. Okay. Well, that is significantly better. Is that enough to build? It's enough to actually build two buildings at once. Excellent. Okay, I'm happy with that. Base value, construction center in Campia, construction center in Calabria, construction center in Apulia. Wait, are each one of you actually worth five? Maybe? 0.5. I mean, maybe it's based on how many people are actually employed in the fact. Yeah, it's probably also based on how many people are working at the construction center. That actually makes a lot of sense. But we're getting decent. 26? I mean, it's much better than I think we were starting off at nine. So I'm, I'm happy with where, where, where this is at right now. How's our military, by the way? Line infantry. I'm assuming we don't we don't have any like military tech, so we can't really improve any of these units yet. Wheat farms. What what do we not have? We can build some more urban stuff, steel mill, arts academy. University. I mean, it's gonna lose us. Does, does anything actually make us money? Steel mills, arts academy. No, we need an arts academy for something, right? As building Art Academy has activated traditional art. The workforce occupancy is greater than 90%. Building level. Yeah, so you know, let's let's do that. Let's see if we can get romanticism. Let's build an arts academy in the capital. And then we'll make it uh you not not you. Arts Academy. We want it to be uh traditional art, which is at right now. Yeah, I mean, we can't really change too much here, so we'll just keep it as is. And how is the urbanization going? 20%, at least 75% of all eligible Sicilian states has a building urban center. Building levels greater, at least level 5. How good is the urban building, though? The urban center. Um... I think it's in this. There it is. I mean, we have three of them. We can. We can. Do we need to subsidize anything? I don't think so right now. 
Can I build, we can build a Statue of Liberty, potentially. Maybe it's a rural building? Coal I mean, coal mines could be nice. We love, we love putting kids in the coal mines. Let's throw a coal mine here. We might as well get all of our, like, raw material stuff done. Yeah, build an iron mine. Don't build it level 2 quite yet. Yeah, just, just level 1 for now. Apparently, max level is at 24. Anything else? Coal mine, cotton plantations. Here, let's get a cotton plantation up in the north as well. Just let's start building a little bit of everything. I mean, we are running a little bit of a deficit, but we have a, a, a large... Uh, stockpile of, of, of cash so i'm not too worried about losing the money right now we should be okay okay so the pope likes us more you like us more what's your opinion on us right now sort of Piedmonts? you're at 33 and yeah we're getting a bonus due to our alliance would any of you want an alliance or defensive pact negative 13 i was like maybe but but not quite yet Actually, I want to look at my diplomatic lens. Would anybody be willing to take an alliance with us? No, just Sardinia Piedmont. Defensive pact. You would not accept. You would not accept. But that we can actually we can offer it. Rivalry. Trade agreement. You would not accept. Nobody wants a trade agreement either. Any any of you? Anybody anybody in Europe wants to trade with me? No, you're all you're all jerks. I mean it's a little sad. And I don't think we want to do any diplomatic plays. The king intervenes in political process. The king has taken a personal interest in the ongoing debate uh, concerning the National Guard. And it is resolved that he uses royal prerogatives to ensure the law passes. So we could just pass the bill outright. The, the king can be like, you know, I want this bill now. So we could, we could get it done. Actually, no, it's, it's a 20% chance of it being enacted. The king actually can't guarantee it. But the petite bourgeoisie, the intelligentsia, and the industrials will all be kind of mad about it. So it's going to be... I'll, I'll take a negative 9% chance of passing now. Fantastic. But I, I don't want to make everybody in the country mad at us. Also, the armed forces love us now. 30% offensive defensive bonus is the petite bourgeoisie. Uh, they are providing us with a 10% bioxy bonus. Oh, that's actually about 155 now. Fantastic. And we have a treasury bond. 10% loan interest. Or actually, or did I build... I guess I built my other buildings, right? Oh, so you're 70 by itself. We can give more p power to the to the landowners, but... I don't, I don't think we want to do that. I don't, I don't think we need to do that. Also, do we have elections? I don't think we do. No, we don't. We don't have elections. Maybe at some point we'll become the constitution of democracy, but not not quite yet. And I mean, the only people really mad at us are the intelligentsia. And do we do we really need to worry about them? Probably not. We need to import more paper. If I need to import more paper, I'll try to import more paper. Silly market balance. Okay, there we go. We 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 dealt with our paper uh, crisis. So we're no longer spending way too much money on basic, basic goods. But I think that at least for right now, it's going to be a good time for us to end our very first episode of Victoria 3. So I hope you enjoyed. Uh, if you have, remember to thumbs up. Now enjoy, click thumbs down. You want to see more, subscribe, and goodbye.